Zach Carson, I think a big gorilla fell off your back today. Yeah. Uh, you finally get a state title in Ohio. Uh, Steed, familiar foe. Uh, yeah. How many times? That was the fourth time I wrestled in the last uh, three. I wrestled in sectionals districts this year and once last year. What was your record? 4-0. 4-0. Yep. Sometimes, guys, you know, yeah. you look, uh, actually, um, their new house yeah. beat Mackle. Yeah, he was 0-5 against Mackle. Right, right. Were you thinking about that at all? Um, I mean, there's a little bit that you're thinking about that way, but you try and keep those doubts out, try and keep your, uh, try and keep positive and uh, think of the right thoughts, staying focused. And, I mean, I did that, and I executed the game, same game plan I've been wrestling for the last four matches. I look at you, and you've had a lot of peaks and valleys in your career, man. State finalist as a sophomore against Dean Heil. Uh, and then, you know, I look at last year, you know, getting the state final. Uh, you, you know, you end up going to Eastern Michigan. You commit to Eastern Michigan. Highlight of your career. This has got to be the highlight of your career. And you've had and you had huge wins as, a, as an eighth grader, as a freshman. You were beating really good guys, but you never quite got right, where you, right. we thought you could be. Yep. What's it like to get this one? It's unbelievable. I mean, it's, it's everything I've been working for for a long time. And I mean, it's just good to go out there. And I mean, for everybody that's helped me, everybody that's worked to help me get to where I am today. I mean, it's just unbelievable and it's, it's amazing. You guys have a long-lasting relationship with uh, Dave Bullard. Yeah. He's head coach at Eastern. Mm -hmm. Knowing you're going to wrestle for him next year, what's that mean to you? Uh, it's, it means a lot. I mean, I trust uh, trust him. Coach Klein, coach in high school, it means a lot that Coach Klein, uh, coach Klein knows that he uh, Boyard will uh, Coach Boyard will uh, help me and get me to where I need to be to do well in college. And I believe that he will, and I'm ready to go do it. The loss in the uh, Top Gun finals, it was it was a head scratcher to me. I didn't, I didn't, uh, Dobbin always had a game plan for you, but yeah, he's, looking uh, at that match, did you take? Is that the last time you lost? Yeah, I have lost to Dobbin to well, one of Brexville semis and uh, Top Gun finals. And those are my only two losses this year. Looking at those two losses, how much did they help you for that um, out there today? It helped me a lot. It helped keep me focused. I think last year I uh, didn't lose until the state semis, and I think, I mean, I, I'm good at uh, keeping around it and uh, just uh, staying focused whether I win or lose to work on what I need to work on but those are kind of eye openers that I need to develop on bottom a little more and develop uh, ways to score on people that uh, don't tie up and uh, stall. So, uh, you did a pretty good job of it. Yeah. Uh, your dad, scale of 1 to 10, <laughs> 10 being he's going to fly out of the freaking arena pumped, 1 being like uh, probably when he's asleep. 11. <laughs> what do you say to your dad? Uh, just thank him for everything he's done. Uh, just he's uh, been there, always been there for me. Always uh, tries to help. Always does what he can, and it uh, means a lot. I mean, it's, he's always there for me. It's good to know he's behind me. All right, I'm gonna go say congratulations to him. You got anything else for me? No, sir. Congratulations, man. Yep, thank you.